transmission. Engines full power. And lift off. NASA astronaut Nicole Mann has made history. And here we come through. First one through the hatch is going to be Nicole Mann, commander of Dragon. And now the first Native American woman to live and stay aboard the International Space Station. She says she feels proud to represent the Wailaki of the Round Valley Indian tribes in Northern California. I think it's important that we recognize that there are all different types of people on board the International Space Station, not only from different countries, but from different backgrounds and different nationalities. What that does is it just highlights our diversity and how incredible it is when we come together as a human species, the wonderful things that we can do and that we can accomplish. Nicole's influence has motivated others with indigenous backgrounds to have an interest in NASA. There were some boards at NASA with uh, people that have our indigenous background or that are natives that have come together and that have followed on the mission because they heard that a Native American is going to space and that has excited them. I think that's great. Now that she's in space, Nicole and the rest of the team hope their work can make the Earth a better place to live. I think the space exploration does a lot for us looking beyond low Earth orbit, but it also does a lot to benefit humans on Earth. That allows us to expand, to grow, and to learn. The more that we can learn about our planet Earth, the better we can do to take care of her. This is Inside Edition Digital.